executing. If you would like to speak with a specialist, please ensure you are on site to assist with troubleshooting before you are connected. Para el Español o Prima Ocho. If you need assistance with your power wall battery, press 2. If you need your call may be monitored or recorded for quality purposes. For expedited assistance, please visit our enhanced online tutorial at tesla.com slash support to troubleshoot most system errors or submit a request for additional troubleshooting. All right, so um, we had a power outage yesterday at our house, <clears throat> or in our community, rather. And although the Tesla Powerwall did not fail, what did fail was my <laughs> Powerwall is offline. So yesterday we tried it for about a good 45 minutes. Your estimated hold time is greater than one hour. So there we go. So the uh, power wall did not fail, but my phone could not connect after the initial power uh, was lost in my community. I, I don't know why, I don't know what happened. But anyway, uh, we went through this whole maturation of trying to reset the power wall um, and also the, the panel outside. And the panel outside, I'm gonna show you what that looks like here is this panel here with the two black tops on them right here. Um, there is a reset on the panel. Sorry, there's a reset right here. You have to hit reset for a certain amount of time and then um, you should hopefully connect, but for some reason it didn't work. So my summation is that uh, one, I haven't had a, a push update for years. <laughs> I don't have any new software update for my Powerwall for years. Okay, so uh, I just put in my cell phone number and they're gonna call me back in about 53 minutes. So right now it's uh, 449, so hopefully they'll call around 550, I don't know, whatever it is. but. Uh, long story short, we try to reset the power wall uh, by pressing the, the reset button that I just showed you. Then I went um, back in the house and had to put in some information for my power wall. My, um, there's a, basically a password and they give you a 16 digit um, SSID. And then I had to go downstairs and click the power wall off and then click it on. And none of that worked. It worked for a little bit. Uh, uh, we thought it was about to sink. It was spinning, spinning, spinning. And I guess the tech got tired of holding uh, on because at this point we tried it like three times. So I guess he was ready to move on to somebody else. So he gave me the dust off of, and I hope this is true. He said, well, uh, I will uh, push a new update. See, you haven't had an update in a while and hopefully that will speed things up. So here I am on day two, trying to get my power wall uh, and my phone to work together in concert. So if you did not see this, uh, I apologize again because I was uh, on phone and then I realized that uh, we had uh, music in the background, so I don't want to get hit with any copyright. Um, they now it says, uh, and it's been saying this for a while, that the power wall is offline. And when you tap the power wall, then they give you uh, like the change of Wi-Fi settings or you know whatever whatever they're telling you to do. And I don't want to change my Wi-Fi settings uh, unless they tell me to change my Wi-Fi settings. Uh, basically, my Wi-Fi is, you know, with my Verizon, and then you have to have your own Wi-Fi, blah, 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 and all kind of stuff. So uh, I'm going to go down here and just show you what my Powerball looks like. I mean, it's a Powerball. It's, it's uh, the signature red. Uh, it's that power. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, boy. Okay, here we go. So I'm gonna just show you what the power wall looks like real quick. I mean, you've seen all, you've seen them all. There's nothing special. This is power wall two. No, again, nothing, nothing one and on, except that it's uh, the signature red. And everybody was falling over when they had the Model S's roll out. They did a signature red color, and and everybody was gravitating towards that. So I was lucky enough to get a signature 
red here. And yeah, there you go. So I have some information up here on that tag and on that book right there on that uh, post-it note with some information on what I need to do. So I'm pretty sure I'll be down here for the next hour or so. Um, not only do I have to wait for them to call, but also this whole 15 minute, 10, 15 minute deal of go outside and then press the reset button and come down here. And then you click off, click this button that I'm pointing to right here. You click this button on, and then you wait a couple of seconds and you, I mean, you click it off and then you click it on and then they'll tell you to put in your information and blah, 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 blah. And you have to wait because it takes about five minutes to catch up what I just did. And then after that, then hopefully it'll work. We shall see. Over an hour. Still waiting. So I have Tesla on the phone now after waiting for uh, well over an hour, maybe an hour and 15 minutes. She is trying to do it on her end and we'll see what happens. Well, this process can take up to five minutes, so I haven't started the clock, but I think I'm well past the uh, minute three. Man, I really hope this blue line comes over. If not, man, I'm gonna have to submit defeat and call Tesla, but I must admit, it looks like I'm much further than I was yesterday with this extender. Uh, so it looks like now I'm um, getting close to happiness again <laughs> um <clears throat> this has been a, a three-day uh, adventure uh, the my neighborhood lost lights as i might have mentioned before in the video um and i didn't lose lights but my phone um somehow got disconnected from the power wall the power wall was down i, I don't know if it was down or not but it didn't show that the power wall was um, um was charging or discharging in this instance i think it was because we didn't lose any lights and it's kind of tough to see it was about six uh seven o'clock in the uh, evening so i couldn't really tell if anybody lost lights or not because it was in the daytime but long story short i looked at my phone and saw that my phone was not connected to the power wall and so thus uh i was on the phone with the first tech for well over an hour and he kind of gave up and said he's going to push some new uh, software updates to my very old 2016 slash 2017 um <laughs> tesla power wall which is all good. And uh, then I called it yesterday, right after I got home from work. And again, it was getting late. And when I finally got somebody on the phone, I think I showed you in the previous video, that um, she was very nice. And she told me to go to, to one of the big box stores and get an extender, which I did. And I got a neck gear. And looks like now, I'm, I'm hopefully I'm there. I'm so darn close. Um, this is my new extender over here. But I'm so darn close to uh, getting this all thing connected. Now I'm, I'm I'm panicking a little bit because it's taking a while for it to connect to my Verizon uh, router. And damn it, connection timed out. Oh my God, man, it's always some. Excuse me for my bad language. It's it's always something. So um, I'm going to uh, put this phone down and uh, I'm going to walk around the house frantically. And I, I, we'll just see what's happening. Bye. So uh, what you didn't hear was that the uh, Tesla Powerwall people won't be available for uh, another 129 minutes. I kid you not. That's what they said. So, <laughs> so I'm going to wait. Obviously, I'm going to go downstairs and do something. Watch a movie. <laughs> All right, I, I'm without words. I'm, I'm getting tired of, I don't know. It's just disappointing. Okay, 129 minutes uh, from now, hopefully we'll have some resolution on this. All right, so I'm gonna try this by myself again. Uh, it's telling me to go down and click onto the button of the power wall. <laughs> this, this is so super frustrating for, especially for me, 
you would think I'm a tech guy, but I don't enjoy this. <laughs> I'm not enjoying this at all. So I turn it off and then turn it on. And then I don't know what to do. I don't know if I need to go upstairs and stand by the day going what? So it's telling me now that uh, select this reading. I'm literally trying to do this on the seat of my pants. And after being on the phone with Tesla twice in two days and, and probably the third time they're gonna call, I, I don't know what's gonna happen. So what I can tell you right now is I got a freaking metal box that I don't know if it's working or not. And I'm pretty sure it's not gonna connect. I don't know what I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. One person told me to go stand outside when it's 95 degrees out there and stand near it, the panel, and then come back in, then come down here, and then go back upstairs to the router. All right, um, I had to calm down. Uh, if, I, if I have attitude, I, I truly apologize, and typically I'm not one that gets mad. Well, if I'm on this YouTube channel, uh, I rarely ever get mad because I had to calm down for a minute because um, I had a uh, not a too good conversation with um, a Tesla person. I wish I would have recorded him after being on the phone for 129 minutes. He typically just said, um, um, what is your issue? And I, and I told him that I called twice. <clears throat> gave him my name he says he puts me on hold a brief hold um true to his credit it was very brief maybe 15 seconds and he got back on the phone and he he intentionally uh, uh, said okay i read the notes and i sent you a link and i'm like wait a minute uh this is like beyond the link because i've had a link for the last <laughs> few days and nothing is working and he just said i just sent you the link and then he proceeded to um uh, cancel the call now, that was truly, truly unprofessional and unacceptable. If he doesn't like his job, he should quit, right? <laughs> um, but to be on the phone waiting for 129 minutes plus, you'd think I would get something a little better than, than that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to wait another day and then I'm going to call again. And I will continue to call until I get some proper service, because that's just me. So while I fight this fight, I'm gonna continue to record uh, what I can, and I will be giving you updates when I get them.